And here's the Madrid roster, packed full of firepower as ever. Just about any one of these players capable of stepping up and being the star on offense on any given night. Randolph, Campasso, Tavares, Yui, the standout superstars perhaps. New signing Jordan Mickey with the tools to become one as well. Far more rotation on this Shalgiris roster in the offseason. Hayes, Landale and Day, big guys all capable of becoming big players this season. And in the backcourt, the return of fan favourite Le Caritas complements the experience of Malaknis and the improvement of up-and-comers Walker and Gregonis. For the second game in a row here, at the start of the new season, a sellout of over 15,000. And I guarantee it will seem like double a special, special basketball setting. We're ready for the introduction of the two sets of players. Please welcome. Starting, of course, with the visiting team from the Spanish capital, Real Madrid. 2-0 so far, both games coming on home court. They edged Fenerbahce by four points in round one, a rematch of the 2018 final. And their ability to move the ball well on offense to create good shots proved the difference. They racked up 23 assists in that one, en route to shooting 61% inside and 46% from long range. And then last week they survived by the skin of their teeth to beat Maccabi by just a single point. JC Carroll hitting a game winner with 2.4 seconds remaining. Again, they moved the ball well for 18 assists, double the tally of Maccabi. A spectacular setting and no doubt the most spectacular introduction in EuroLeague basketball. Goosebumps greeting for João Guerreiro's countouts.
Two so far, they stuck with Basconia most of the way here in round one, getting within four points in the fourth quarter, but they were held to just three points in the last eight minutes. required tonight you could cut the pride and passion with a knife <laughs> 